evening and welcome to tonight's upload. My name's Emma. Don't forget to go and subscribe for vlogs, which I do every week, and I also do lots and lots of hauls. So I'm back tonight with a home bargains haul, and this is kind of like quick. We went last night, Steve and I and um, Ethan, because everyone's on a play day. I'm filming it today, and it's going up tomorrow. So it's quickly because quick, because this week Ethan's been a bit poorly. So, but he's fine. Don't worry, guys. I was like, do you know what I haven't done for ages? I have done a little sneaky trip around home bargains. So it's split into kind of stuff for the kiddos, Halloween -y stuff, and homeware stuff. So buckle in. I'm wearing a black top, but I've actually got my pajama bottoms on. That's how cozy I am, because it's autumn. Right, starting off with the Halloween stuff. This was the best bargain. It is a, and you can have it outdoors as well, but I'm gonna have it by my office. It's a this is Halloween, Halloween doormat. But it was like, oh, I was like, I saw the five and I was like, mm, five pound, okay. It was like one pound seventy-four. I'm a little bit regretful I didn't buy more. So this is gonna go outside my office. I know that you can wipe your feet on, it's more like a decorative. A decorative doormat, I mean, everybody needs one of those in their lives, don't they? Another thing I got, and this was, oh, I don't know, a pound or two pound, I think, a little pumpkin plate. I like these little plates, have them in the kitchen to put nice little treats on, little cupcakes and stuff for the festive season, so that'll go nice in my kitchen. I also picked up this for 2 99 So it is the Wix. Oh, so Wickford & Co. Halloween. It's, it is a really, it, if you've got this candle, could you tell me what it reminds you of? It reminds me of like sweets. I wouldn't say this is a pumpkin-y kind of candle, but it's really nice. And a lot of you on Insta stories, you must go and follow me on Instagram, guys. Go and do it now. Um, recommended the gingerbread home bargains candle, so I will be getting that as well. Okay, some other home bits and pieces. I did mention in last week's vlog about perhaps doing a Hinch haul or any of you watching Hinch out there. I like kind of dabble and stuff in it, but I'm not like the biggest cleaning guru, like looking around to see if my house is filthy. But if you want me to do a Hinch haul or you want me to talk a bit more about her, let me know. If you don't know who Hinch is, perhaps if you don't live in the UK, go and check her out on Instagram. I think she's just called Mrs. Hinch. It should come up, she's got a lot of followers. So I obviously picked up couple of packs of my favourite dental wipes guys that will be going in my bathrooms and also I went for I've got some Harpic bleach just in active fresh pink blossom not gonna lie I got it because I like the outside of it because bleach is bleach isn't it I mean I know that it makes bleach a little bit more attractive in the packaging but I suppose it just cleans your toilets some dusters it's all about the glamour 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 we just love the glamour <laughs> Dusters. You thought dusters were glamorous. I picked up some of these. What are these called? Sponges to for cleaning as well. Stop being jealous of my rock and roll lifestyle. Stephen picked up, he was like, we need some sif. So Stephen picked up some sif as well. So that's the cleaning stuff we've got. And for the kiddos, because everybody's suffering a bit from sore lips. If you will see on my vlog, I had really bad sore lips, so I've just picked up a little a little cheeky Vaseline, which is a couple of quid. They're always good to have in the house. And do you remember that L'Oreal Alviv that I used to love, the yellow one? It doesn't exist anymore, guys. You can't get it anywhere. So I picked up this big bugger, I think about three pounds, an XXL shampoo. It's ridiculous, it's excessive. But I reckon, I reckon this will last until Christmas, at least. And finally, for my little sister, I saw these, and I'm seeing it later, so I might take them. They're wax melts, and she, mom and dad, um, don't like candles in the house. It's Claire's saying mom and dad at the moment. They don't like candles in the house, so she's got like a wax melt thing. So I got that, and they're forty nine p, and it is home baking. Let's see what it smells like. Any of you use wax melts rather than candles? Let me know in the comments because you know I'm a candle thing. It does smell very nice. I'd say that is very festive. So I'll keep I'll keep you reported. Keep you reported. Keep you keep you up to date. I got three of these big boxes as well, and these were four pound each to go in my office because I'm going to have a box that's like a box for products that I have to review, a box for products I'm going to give to charity, and a box for products that um, I might do giveaways and stuff. So they're going to go in my office, and they should look really nice. And then on to the, um, oh no, look at this. Stephen went, Emma, and I was like, what? 49p, bath bombs. 
Simply Bath Bombs. So he chose for me lavender, and that's nice, mango, and rose. So I'll let you know if they're, they're any good. I have no idea. I will say I struggle getting them out of the wrappers and they're all covered in plastic. But I'll keep you posted on those. So. Okay, kids stuff. So we are going to... Very soon. So there's some bits in here for that. And there's also some bits in here for the reward box. So uh, a lot of you will remember that I do reward box with my kids. And every week if they get a certain amount of ticks, they get to pick something out of the reward box. So, the reward box stuff, because Home Bargains is a prime reward box picking up things. Ethan picked this to go in the reward box. Who the hell is that man? Oh, it's the um, it's from Alice to the Looking Glass. That's like 99p, I think. I got, um, got this little Thunderbirds as well. These will all, well, these will all be a pound, but these are things that Ethan chose to got in, to put in. Stephen got this. I think this was like 49p, maybe. It's like a little charm thing. You make charm bracelets. So that's gone in for Eric. I love things like this. Things like this are really good when you do pass the parcels. So I always like grab as many as I can. So I was like, get a couple of those, got a couple of those. And I picked up this for Ethan for a pound. Just a really nice little flask. It's just got Pokemon on. The kids do street dancing every week and they have to take a flask with them. So this is really good for that, just to take um, to their dancing. So you can have a little drink and pop. And, oh, another thing. This is 99p, I think. Fungus Among Us. Ethan wanted it. We have got four because we're going at Halloween, I thought, um, I do every day when we're on holiday, I do like little plastic bags full of snacks. Because when you go to, when you go to Disney World, you get your magic bands, you can have snacks and it's fine. It's all included. When you go to Disneyland Paris, it's not. So you have like quite a good portion of the day where you don't really have any snacks or anything. So I will make them each a snack bag to have during the days we are there. So could you let me know if you want me to do more about that or more about how I organize that? Um, so to put in there, we've got some, some lollipops. They say they have, it's not Halloween, it's just normal lollipops, isn't it, in a Halloween thing, looking at it. What a bloody rip-off, what a bloody rip-off. This is a quiz, so put these, it's quite nice. Uh, we're there for five days, it's a ten, so they can have one each day. I also thought these were really funny. They're called goo heads. Do we think these are like Cadbury's cream eggs? But for Halloween version, I'll let you know. There's five. I feel I'm. I think I'm gonna have. To, I already know. I'm gonna have to go and rebuy these because I wanna have. I wanna try one now. I won't do it on camera. But as soon as I turn you off, shoving a goo head in my mouth. With hindsight, shoving a goo head in my mouth weirdly sounds rude, but I don't know why. I also got these, which are absolutely disgusting. I would never want to eat them, but it's Halloween and it's half term, so I thought they'd be quite fun, just some little sweets. And then these were 19p19. They're just little fruiticles, which Ethan's really likes. Just a little like um, tub with some little snacks in, and I think it comes with like a little, I don't know, cars coin, but I thought those might be quite good from the plane for him. I got this for Erin from the plane. It's always good when you're on a plane journey to have something they can open, because it like distracts them from like going up in the air. And I need to find one for Ethan, but this is for Erin. I also like to do like, uh, in fact, I'll link above and below what I pack. But this is also really good, so she can just do some like colouring. I think this is a pound Disney princess. Some gel pens, everybody loves a gel pen. I mean, Stephen probably doesn't love comedy gel pens. I've just found these, and these were a pound each as well, to go in the reward box. Zomlings or Zoomlings? It's a load of old tat, isn't it? But if my kids are going to be good for seven days in a row, and all they require to be good is a 99p toy, I am going to bloody do it. And finally, for the plane, these were 79p each. I got sticker 
play and chanting activities, which is just, you know, some stickers and some things they can play. And I also got a Pixar one for Ethan, which is really good. I might go back and get a Pixar one for Erin as well because she likes Pixar. Who doesn't like Pixar? So there we go. That's it, guys. That's a little cheeky home bargains haul. Um, let me know if you want me to do. I haven't done a Poundland one for a while. I could perhaps go to a really big Poundland. I was thinking about doing maybe like a Halloween kind of decoration tour. Let me know what you want to see. Let me know in the comments. Um, I will see you Wednesday. We're back for a vlog, and I will see you on Sunday. And I don't know what I'm going to film. I have been thinking about doing a disney mug collection haul but then i worried that that was very niche so i don't know if i should do it like a chatty kind of talking about all the mugs <laughs> even now i'm saying it it sounds like it's a very terrible idea but you let me know i will see you for another upload soon i love you lots and whatever you're doing this evening have a fantastic time night guys <laughs>